Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. What do we know about Kola Wale Ajayemi? Kola Wale Ajayemi's full name is Kola Wale Uluwa Shogun Ajayemi. He was born on January 17 and is originally a native of Ogbomosho in Oyo State. He also attended Ogbomosho Grammar School in Ogbomosho. Also, Kola Wale Ajayemi is popularly known as Awilo. He started acting in 1997 while being under the mentorship of Shogun Ugumbe, a popular director and the son of the late actor and filmmaker Akin Ugumbe. He has produced over 25 movies and has starred in more than 100 movies, such as Ijogbon, Ibigiga, Sunday Dagoru, Irokunla, Bemisiri, Orilowo, and so much more. Aside his acting, he is also the founder of Aji Omwaje School of Performing Arts, which is located in Ibadan, Ogun State. He is also the CEO of Kola Wale Clothes. Many people do not know this, but Kola Wale Ajayemi's father is a musician. So why did he decide to venture into acting? He revealed that when he was little, he used to love seeing people on the screen, which makes him wonder how they got into the screen. He said this inspired him to do the same thing, and he held on to that dream because he wanted to be seen on screen. Then he started acting in church and schools in the year 1997. He started acting on stage, school shows, and dramas, and many more. So how does he get ready for a role? He said, preparing for the role is the first thing. Whenever I'm being called by any producer to play a role, I will ask them to give me the script and we negotiate on my terms and conditions. Once that is settled, the next thing for me is my personal rehearsal in my room. After that, when we get to the location in the hotel room, I go through the script again. By the time you are called on set, you won't give the director any problem. It's all rehearsals. Before I was trained under Shegun Akane Ogunbe, he was also trained by Isiaka Udutola, popularly known as Omiogbo, in Ilori. Apart from being an actor and a movie producer, he's also a director. He has directed a lot of works, including Iwasi, Ajinibe, and Wurimeta, among others. On how far he's willing to go in the movie industry, he revealed that he wants to go as far as being fulfilled in what he does. He wants his movies to be a point of reference that uniquely makes a great impact in the development of the country. He also wants to be an internationally known actor. He does not want to be limited to the shores of Nollywood. He wants to mingle with Hollywood and Bollywood. In total, he has directed more than 80 movies, produced more than 25 movies, and acted in over 50 movies. Let's talk about his personal life. Kolawale Ajayemi was a single father. He has a teenage daughter, Timitokwe Ajayemi, before he got married to the popular Yoruba Nollywood actress, Toyin Abraham. Together, they have been blessed with a son, Iwe. In March, the actor celebrated his daughter, who turned a year old, sharing photos of himself and his daughter. The actor penned sweet words alongside a picture. He wrote, to my wonderful daughter, Timmy Tokwe, let me start by saying that I love you. It's been a pleasure watching you grow into an amazing young lady. I want you to be confident in yourself, know that you are beautiful, and understand that you can do anything you set your mind to. I want you to work hard for what you want in this life and stand firm by your morals and values. Never let anyone disrespect you. Believe in God and strive for greatness. I will always be here to love, guide, and support you. My angel, daddy loves you, you root. Over the years, he has been honored with a lot of awards and also nominated for several. Kola Wili Ajayemi was nominated for City People Movie Award for Best New Actor of the Year Yoruba, City People Movie Award for Best Supporting Actor of the Year Yoruba, just to mention a few. How did he get the name Awilo? Kola Wili Ajayemi's popular name in movies is Awilo. This is because he takes up dancing rules that require a certain level of ruggedness. Kola Wili and Tony Abraham are one of the most talked about couple in Nigeria. They featured together for the first time since Time the Note in August 2019 in Dear Afik, the movie directed by the celebrated media entrepreneur Samuel Olatunji, popularly known as Big Sam. The movie also featured other Nollywood superstars such as Afizo Yetoro, Jideko Sokko, William Zuchimba, Kenny Bankole, Mauli Gavo, Charles Inoje, Chine Duikedize, Fetia Williams, Bimbo Ademoye, Bimbo Akitola, and so many other people. The romantic comedy tells the story of a beautiful career lady who is about to get married to the man of her dream, who is also on the verge of selling millions of narrow words of contract with a conglomerate in the construction industry. However, he is faced with the devil and the deep blue sea, as selling the contract is hinged on him having an intimate affair with the female billionaire contractor by all means, just few weeks to his own wedding. Just 18 days ago, 
Kola Ole Ajayemi took to social media to give love advice. In a post shared on his Instagram page, the actor advised people to use their brains and swallow their pride when it comes to love. Kola Ole and Tony Abraham started dating as far back as 2017. Although marrying an actor used to be a dream, the mother of one revealed that she did not take him seriously as she did not want to have an the mother of one revealed that she did not take him seriously as she did not want to have anything to do with an actor following the crash of her marriage to Adeni Johnson. In her words, she said, I told God that I want to marry wherever I am working because I'm this kind of person that plays a lot. I'm a very playful person and sometimes some people don't really understand me. So I want to get married to a man who is in the same field as me so I don't have to keep explaining myself to my husband all the time. We have been friends for over 10 years. You know all those kind of quiet guys. I'm always looking at him like, he's too quiet, he's calm. There's this my friend who happens to be his family friend. So whenever he comes to see him, I do ask him why he's so reserved. He will just accept you for who you are. He's that kind of guy. The kind of guy that accepts everyone, won't try to change you or make you feel less of who you are, she said. Also, Kalawale Ajayemi is a lover of music and his favorite artists include Osho Raymond, Ayifele, Tokpala Bitu Baba and Pasuma. See Kalawale Ajayemi with his lovely family.
We have come to the end of this episode on this Yoruba Nollywood actor, Kualawale Uluwa Shogun at GM. We hope you enjoyed this episode and listen to two new things. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.